All right, so TNA released the new design for the Tag Team Championship yesterday. I was not able to react at the time. Um, just had too much going on. So I am I am a day late on this, and I'll probably be a day late on most of my reactions, if I'm just being honest with you. Hopefully not, though. Um, but yes, the Tag Team titles have come out. And um, they're growing on me a little bit. They did not have the impact to me that the x division championship had you know the to me the x division championship is extremely classy and when i did my x division reaction i probably should have actually given a close-up of the belt so i'm going to do it now why not you know to me this is just very classy as i said it represents the past but i think it represents the future as well and i think it's just going to look great on whoever whoever has it these came out and i just did not react the same way they they still are very very nice. I mean, there's there's many comparisons to this and the X Division Championship, but my first reaction to seeing these were that they were the Knockouts Tag Team Championships. So that is the overall issue that I have with them. They have been grown on me a little bit, especially seeing them up close like this. Because previously, when I wasn't seeing them up, up close and it was just showing Scott doing the video, I was like, man, I'm I'm just not feeling those. Um, but you know, I got to give props once again to the, uh, the social media job that they did with, um, you know, and these videos have the, the X division championship has doubled the Samoa Joe video that everyone loves so much. And, uh, these ones already have half of that video, you know, and that Samoa Joe's been out for eight days and, you know, we're talking X division out for 24 hours and, and what have you, but, uh, you know, I, I just, I love them doing this kind of social media. I'm 44 now. I've been doing this, I think, since I was 34 covering this company. And I've been bitching about their social media from day one. You know, and um, obviously you can't release new titles every other week, every other month. You know what I mean? But they've done, we've seen many new titles released over the years and they haven't done anything like this. And doing the video release and then doing the images with the wrestlers with the belts. I mean, it, it's... I could not have scripted it any better myself, you know, so I'm just very proud with uh, the changes that they're making. But I do think just the overall shape with the uh, the angles at the top just just look like they would be th these belts would be on the girls. That's my only real, real issue with it. I didn't have the issue that the pre a lot of people had with the previous belts, previous tag titles. I, th I thought they looked OK, but I think under impact the belts were all smaller than people would have liked especially the world title and we're going to get in that and i'll probably repeat this when we get into the world title but you know when kenny omega had the belt he would wear the tna title and put the impact one over his shoulder because it looked better that the belt looked better it was bigger i mean it it made the um, impact title look like a it looked like a secondary title like it looked like the old intercontinental title you know it just it just wasn't um it was a nice belt but we'll we'll talk about the world title later but um you know ace and bay got these belts and um uh, i just think the red strap though is very unnecessary because you know a lot of the reason that i i've gotten you know the last several years got on here and and knocked them over this obsession with red that they have is that red doesn't go with everything and sometimes you have to be a little more neutral in your colors so with the x division championship like you can put that on anybody that's going to look incredible you put these on they're, they're not going to look the same on everybody they're not they just don't look as prestigious in my opinion you know my son has a pair of nikes that are really really nice they're like a um like an aqua blue i guess and blue is a little more complimentary to everything but he can't wear those shoes often based on his actual outfits because they don't look good they don't look right because the shoes stand out so much and that's kind of how i feel with this you know like i think these are going to look really good on some people and i think they're going to look really bad on some others you know so we'll see but uh i think over over on social media what i saw was a very similar reaction and a little mixed reaction but i would say the majority of the people have liked these or the majority of people it's grown on them in a very quick amount of very short amount of time. Like very quickly they looked at it and like, I'm, I, don't, I don't know. And then they're kind of, okay, okay, I can dig it. But they are very similar to the X division, but, but they are also very different.
So I definitely like him a lot less than the X Division Championship. And, you know, the X Division one, to me, every single year is always the worst looking title. I know people probably don't agree with that, but I always think that like that's the worst looking one out of the out of, out of all of them. But it's going to be hard to top that X Division one, <laughs> I think. Uh, so this one, you know, these ones, uh, they let me down a little bit, but at the same time, they're beautiful. You know, it just really wasn't what I expected. I really would have just went with the black straps personally, but um, they went red. And, uh, you know, I guess I guess it looked okay. I guess I guess a lot of people like that, but this didn't hit for me the same way the X Division Championship did. Uh, we'll be back next to talk the Digital Media Championship. I am I am hoping and praying. I know I'm going to get a lot of DMs the minute these belts come out or the, the belt comes out. I am hoping and praying that they change the name of the title. You know, it's a bad, it's a joke title. It's got a bad name. I'm going to say all this stuff when <laughs> with that upload as well. But they haven't, they had an opportunity to make a cutting edge, excuse, excuse me, cutting edge title and they didn't. So now it's just a regular title. So now you got to change the damn name. You feel me? So we'll see. We'll see what happens when that comes out. But leave your thoughts in the comments about the tag team championship belts.